name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is what is the difference between a full moon and an eclipse. So here we have the moon uh, faces uh, and here is the sun. So we can see if the earth is here and the moon is right here, we see nothing. So this is the new moon. Then we move on to first quarter and then here we have the full moon. So full moon occurs when you have the earth between the moon and the sun. Now how, if we're all in the same line, we should have a lunar eclipse all the time, right? And a lunar eclipse is when the Earth moves between the sunlight and it blocks out the sunlight and it casts a shadow on the moon. So you, it would be something like, from here from the Earth, we will block out the light, and here the moon will look like fairly dark. But what it actually is, is the shadow of the Earth. And that's what a lunar eclipse is. Now, the, the problem here is that this doesn't happen every month. So why doesn't it happen every month? It's because the moon is not in the same orbital plane as all of us. So it's five degrees higher. So because of this inclination, we don't block out the light all the time. So we don't cast our shadow on the moon every single month, every time we have a full moon. And that's the difference between a full moon an eclipse. A full moon is when we don't block out the sunlight and a lunar eclipse is when we block out the sunlight because we're directly in the middle. My name is Eileen Pires and I'm an astrophysicist and this is the differences between a lunar eclipse and a full moon. Mm -hmm.